If there was one thing that was cool about science at school, what was it? What was it? It was... Blowing stuff blowing up. Blowing stuff up, exactly. Imagine getting to do that, though, for a job. Yes, and if you're not blowing stuff up, you're breaking in all manner of different ways. Dean Butler with the message behind the messy mission. If it wasn't for Bruce Wayne... I have the strangest feeling. We wouldn't have Batman. Some days you just can't get rid of a bomb. No Clark Kent. It's a bird! It's a plane! No Superman. And without mild-mannered Michelle Dickinson, there'd be no... Hello, girl! Blow things up. Blow things over, blow your mind. I think I might need a new bin. I think so. Long before she was blowing stuff up, Michelle was breaking things at Auckland University, where she's now a senior lecturer. Fracture mechanics is the science and the engineering of breaking stuff. It's a, not only a thing, people pay me to do it. <laughs> and I never have to put them back together. <laughs> it's like my dream job. But a lack of diversity in science was like kryptonite to Michelle, and thus... Nano Girl was born. And my whole goal is just to expose everybody to science and engineering and get rid of that stereotype because it's there for a reason, but things have changed a lot and, and let's get more girls into it. <laughs> now, villains beware. Michelle's packing a hefty utility belt. From vortexes to flammables to molecular astronomy. To breathe like a dragon out of your nose. Michelle uses her alter ego to battle a baddie called boredom. So Nano Girl is basically, she goes around schools and she teaches kids about science and tries to get them to not think of it as a boring subject but understand that science is all around you and it can be fun. With the school visits, stage shows, web videos, 100-day projects, Twitter, TV and TED Talks, it's no wonder Michelle was recently named the best science communicator in the country. I'm here to break the stereotype, so I'm a woman, I'm an engineer, I have a blast, it's super fun. And fear not, citizens, she's got no plans of hanging up her cape. If you carry on and keep doing this when you're older, are you still going to be Nano Girl? Always going to be Nano Girl. Always going to be What's Nano Girl. What's this grown-up thing we have to do now? Always going to be Nano Girl. Got to love what you do, eh? That's the trick. You got to love what you do. Very cool. Yes. Sadly for me, lowest score in school cert science, 33 percent. Absolute disaster. How, how high was the high score? It was well into the 50s. <laughs>